Hey YouTube, welcome to another content on my channel. This is Hot Tazy Israel, and we're breaking down the uh, Aries Ox. It says the persistent innovator of the Chinese Western Zodiac. Chinese Western. Persistent. Single minded. Diligent. Amazing. Front runner. Pathfinder. So you already know the drill. March 21st to all April 19th. You are the Aries. These are the Yeti Ox. Since these people tend to be very authoritative and assertive. The Aries Ox woman could be quite impulsive and she often ends up regretting it. Uh-oh. A career person, the Aries Ox is very rational and compromised. So that was for the Aries Ox man. Imagine what happens when the real... See, what does it say? Uh, let me look this word up. Alright, again, lost in these deep words. Reliability. Reliability. Amazing. Yep. And the C word. Contemplative. Contemplative. Thoughtful, these are the words here. Yeah. All right. We're gonna breeze through this because I'm already getting irritated reading this article. Unfortunately, I'm sorry, but hopefully, yeah. Up the ox and this I word, holy cow, already. Gotta whip out the dictionary, man. Wow, 4.20 a.m. Huh. I'm just shaking my head reading this article. And which for action of Aries. This is definitely one of the most enthusiastic people there are. Really? Let's get what enthusiastic mean. The enthusiastic. Enthusiastic. Zealous. Energetic. Amazing. Energetic people, there are. One who will tell it as it is. Amazing. No matter the consequences, there are the innovators of our times determined to achieve what others think is impossible. Let's see what this word means. Innovator. A person who introduces new methods, ideas, or products. Developer. Creator. Amazing. All right, let me see. Determined to achieve what others think is impossible. That's amazing. The determined Aries Ox personality. The Aries Oxen are confident and have the determination of the Ox, but they aren't shy as many people born in the year of the Ox are. Wow, so people born in the year of the Ox are kind of shy. But of course, with the Aries, you know, bada bing, bada boom. Assertive, these people know how to express their feelings and they have a deep way of thinking. Amazing. They are open and sociable. Excuse me. And they like to surround themselves with people. Surround themselves with people. Wow. 
You'll discover that the Aries Oxens are honest people who give straight answers no matter how serious the question is. Straight answers. Hmm. They know their ways around conversations and they take other people's feelings into consideration, but they only speak the truth. Wow. Sound like a lawyer. Um, the Aries born the ox year of the Chinese zodiac is powerful. It has enough energy to move the mountains. Holy cow. These are hardworking people and they never like to do things halfway. Whoa. People who have just got the chance to meet them can't see their kind and honest side. Whoa. It takes time to get to know the Aries ox. That's scary. Uh, since they find domestic chores to be difficult, the Aries oxen are a little bit disorganized at home. Disorganized at home? Cluttered. Messy. Uh-oh. Alright, they prefer to do some gardening rather than cleaning the house. This is also because they simply love being outdoors. Top characteristics, bold, expressive, conservative, and honest. Expressive, what are you talking about? Let's see what that means. Expressive. <sighs> wow. Uh, demonstrative, passionate, conservative. Orthodox, stick in the mud, old fashioned, old school. All right, and honest. A natural born leader, the person born in the Aries, the ox year, will know how to stand up for him or herself. Amazing. They are quite conservative when it comes to deciding what job they're going to take or with whom they are going to be friends. As said before, they really don't like cleaning and tidying up. They think these tasks are very boring, but this doesn't mean they're not doing a great job when it comes to something else. They only thrive in professional environments where the progress can be met through steady efforts. Their ambition makes them successful in everything they are doing and they always manage to reach their life goals. An Aries ox will always be successful no matter what he or she be doing and it all due to uncompromising determination. Uncompromising. Uncompromising. Look at that. Die hard. It's headstrong. Stiff neck. That's stiff neck band. Let me see some. Two and thirty, for I knew that they would not hear me, because it is a stiff-necked people. But in the land of their captivities, they shall remember themselves. Wow, stiff-necked. See Exodus thirty-two and nine, and the Lord said unto Moses, I have seen this people, and behold, it is a stiff-necked people. Wow. All right. Stiff necked. Get kind of bored reading this. Okay, an Aries Ox will always be successful no matter what he or she may be doing, and it is all due to, yep. These people tend to be authoritative and to have a bad temper. When the two signs, Western Chinese, 
combined, the person who was born under the channels, the authority and temperance, well, the Aries oxen will always advocate their optimistic outlook on life, convincing others to be happier with the changes that arrive. They expect people to be as energetic and efficient as them. Really? Perfect careers, hospitality, education, music. So they got them bars, programming, and it's a word. They are talkative and they enjoy constructive conversations, especially when they need to take care of business. Those who want to be friends with them need to be on the same level and see things the way the Aries oxen do. Really? Huh. They're not the most sociable people in the Zodiac, and they rarely take the first step in establishing a friendship. Their best friends will be ones they had in childhood as they are not quite interested in making new acquaintances. They don't make new friends easily. Oh, man. But they are truly devoted and loyal to the ones they have they already have wow stubbornness is their main weakness another would be impulsiveness impulsiveness what are they talking about the tendency to act without thinking I'm confused here how the hell do you act without bringing thought into it Man, this world is scary. All right. Holy cow. Um, they get better with age, but when young, they make bad decisions out of boldness, especially when it comes to money. Uh-oh. They learn from past mistakes at each step of their life, and this is the main reason why they constantly evolve with age. You may find an Aries ox to the same place twice, but that doesn't necessarily mean they're stuck. It's just a matter of time when they move on to the next stage in life. You can uh, read the love part on your own. Let's see, most compatible with Leo Rooster, Leo Rabbit, and Leo Monkey. Wow, straight Leo. Rooster, Rabbit, Monkey. Wow, just, just straight Leos. That's all they want is Leo. Lord have mercy. Okay, the Aries Ox woman is known to be impulsive and also to have a bad temper. She only acts without thinking of consequences. That's why many people don't understand her. She is self-confident and energetic but she often can't finish what she has started. It is advisable that she learns how to control her emotions. Listen, um, Aries Ox. I am not the police. Wherever you are, be very careful and, and really do some research on yourself because so far what I'm reading is that you are very arrogant and mean-spirited and you just, like, destroy shit. You got to be careful out there, man. I'm staying out of your way. I'm going to just keep that to you straight because so far this article is saying that you guys are very mean. It's, I just don't understand. Whoa, that, that's not good. But I can understand if I was an Aries Ox, man, I probably... I mean, y'all old school, y'all old fashioned, and uh, y'all only stick with people who you grew up with. But what if they turn their back on you? What do you do? How do you make new friends? Because on here it says you don't even like to meet new friends. You know, those of y'all out there, be careful who you getting yourself involved with. All right, so I'm getting kind of bored reading all this. Let's see. Uh,
Leona Lewis, a British singer. Who else we got? James Par Jim Parsons. Pharrell Williams. I know who that is. That's the the dude who made the song Just Be Happy. Hear this motherfucker. Pause for a minute. And we're back. This is uh, J James Parson. Okay. Pharrell Williams. We should know who this guy is, right? Yeah, this is the guy that looks very young for his age. 47 years old and he still looks like he's 20. Still look like a young man. He got an immortal face. Wowzers. Uh, let's see. Veronica Cartwright. Who is this? Jessica Lang. So far, I only known one name and face out of these this bunch. The rest, I have no idea who they are. Well, I was in a King Kong movie. Okay. How did you think of it? Her face do look just a tad bit familiar. All right. Hopefully we'll wrap this up because I really don't feel like reading all this. Thank you for tuning in. Like, comment, and subscribe to the video. Peace.